Hello guys, welcome to my channel Lockdown Techie. Hope you all are doing safe in this pandemic time. So before going to the video today, I just want to ask you one question that how many of you have wondered at night that instead of watching my favorite Amazon or Netflix series on phone, which I could watch through my laptop or TV without holding my phone and giving pain to my hands. So if you have thought like that, then here's the magic for you. Boom. Now, if you're wondering how that magic happened, this is the reason. You have an inbuilt feature in your phone of screen sharing in both Android and iOS. You have a different name like Samsung has Smart View and some have Cast and iPhone has Screen Mirroring. So without wasting time, let's explore that option. So first we'll be setting up for Android. First you have to ensure that your laptop and mobile phone should be connected in the same network. Here I'll be using iPhone hotspot to connect my OnePlus and laptop and I will be using the Bluetooth connection to connect both laptop and phone. So if you have your uh, Bluetooth connected, means that is paired, then that is fine. You don't need to pair it again. If not, then I'm showing you how can you pair your device, Bluetooth device with your Android. So you open your phone and uh, head towards Bluetooth. And then here you can in laptop, click on add Bluetooth and other devices. When you click, you see that Bluetooth option, click on that, add a device. It will start searching for that. In the meantime, you can just click on pair a new device on your phone and then you will see that laptop would be coming, right? You can just click on that laptop and that will share a security code that will be unique for that device. Okay. And once that is done, you need to approve both the uh, pairing request with the code. So here you can click pair yes and then that's all you see that connection is succeeded that means your device is paired successfully with your laptop now the next step we'll be doing is we need to go to systems and then we need to go to project to this pc so this screen might look something different if you're setting it for the first time for that i will be doing a troubleshooting video as well so you can just click on launch and when you click on launch it will uh, show you the screen and now you have to go to your phone and then click on screencast so when you click on screencast it will search for the devices and it will list your device so you can see that in laptop it's showing ready for connect and once you connect this laptop it will start sharing your screen now you can see that your screen is being shared from your phone to your laptop. Left side is a laptop, right side is a phone. That's all for Android. You are done. Next we'll be seeing the screen sharing setup for iOS. First we'll be doing the installation and then the setup. For installation we'll be using a third party application called APowerSoft. We can even download from Google. I have put the links in the description. You can download it from there as well. So when you click on this A PowerSoft, you need to click on Windows. You have an option for Mac as well, but since we'll be doing for Windows, we'll click on Windows and then it will download here. Once that is downloaded, go ahead for installing it by double clicking on the exe file that is downloaded. Once that is downloaded, we can see that in the desktop as well. Now we'll go for setting up the same setup, like we have to connect our laptop and phone to the same network. Here we don't need to connect to Bluetooth in iPhone case. Just head towards opening the app like I did it, double click on it and see that your app in down shows ready. So that means your machine is ready to be shared. So now go to your uh, phone and connect to the Wi-Fi network like that is connected to your uh, laptop. So like I am using OnePlus here to connect both laptop and uh, phone. So that will be a common network for sharing my screen. Then I'll go for screen sharing mirroring. And in screen mirroring, I see that uh, my A PowerSoft and with the name it is coming. So click on that. Once you click immediately, it will start presenting your screen on your desktop or laptop. Once you can see that the screen started sharing and I can easily do the screen sharing as well. Here in A PowerSoft, you will get an option to record your screen as well. If you click on left side record as, as I did, you can record the screen and then do whatever wants, activities you want to do. But here you will get a logo uh, of A PowerSoft after recording on top. Okay, so we can stop the recording and in order to see the recording, we can click on the folder option. We'll see the recordings as well. Now I can see that I can play those recordings as well. So I can use it anywhere I want like presenting or anywhere I want the recordings to be presented. 
so in order to stop the screen mirroring option you need to go to your iphone and then click on the same screen mirroring option you see that down there is stop mirroring you can click on that and that will stop your screen mirroring of iphone to your laptop that's all thank you so much for seeing the video guys the next video will have top 5 ios mir screen mirroring apps which are absolutely free and the next video will have some tricks for you to watch cricket match or any of your tv serials when you have signal loss in your dts that means if you have any bad weather or anything like such so do stay tuned for this updates if you haven't subscribed the channel please do subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon for the tech updates that i pass on through